Call a rubber match between the two teams to decide who can get the charity shield. As the two teams get ready for their final warm-ups, let's go ahead now and introduce the starting lineups for both squads, starting with Ottawa South United. They finished top of the East with 16 wins. For this, Gary Miller Charity Shield are Ronnie Byfoot with Larry Seen and Lucia Valdez as the assistant referees. Kira Riley is the fourth official as we are underway in our first quarter of side, and she will play towards her in Alinas. Alinas gets around the defender. She gets knocked down. And the referee will point to the penalty. This one will be Lily Jameson. Six goals on the OPDL season. And she puts it into the bottom corner. A perfect dream start for Brampton Soccer Club. As they get on a great counter-attack run. They're able to get it towards their striker in Benikovic. And she held up her run long enough to get some support in Elenas. Elenas continued her run towards the goal, got tripped up, and Jameson buries her. That allowed enough time for Brampton to be able to block it as we see a cross coming in the other way. Now we have a run coming in through on goal for Brampton, and it's into the bottom corner! A brilliant switch towards the far side of the field, and Vanessa Seppe buries it towards the bottom corner, and it's a Brilliant start for this Branton Soccer Club as that one was just past the outstretched leg of Cesario who couldn't block that through ball. She sent in Vanessa Sepe on towards the towards Zabara. Zabara gets tripped it up there. Coming in from Colangelo. And it's gonna lead towards a free kick in a very close area. Some good last minute momentum coming out here. Let's take a look towards the replay of Kalanjo just getting the foot in front of oh, additional minute. As this one's going to get chipped up and just over the crossbar a little bit too high here on the second chance. But instead she's going to play this one towards the middle for Lafrange who tries a shot. That one's going to get saved and a little bit of a slight rebound. But the Ottawa player wasn't able to get there in time as... Coming through on the right side, and good run here for Seppi. She drives away past the defense, and she just got a piece of that one with Smith. She, you could see what as soon as she turned the body to fall on top of it, referee knew, okay, you're not trying to get up. And at least a good ball there from Winter. Here comes the header, and it goes into the goal. They get one back. This one will count. And it's going to be Zena Zabara. Their top goal scorer who got the header. And Ottawa has found a way back in the game. A great free kick coming in from Winter. She plays that one forward. And then there's the Zabara with a looping header over the goalkeeper, Mochi. Waiting for that one to come towards her. And the Brenton striker almost got in front of that one. Elinas, she's driving her way forward, Elinas, and she finishes it! That will do it as Branton get that third goal they're looking for as Abby Elinas puts it home as she gets a huge two-goal lead restored for Branton Soccer Club as they now lead 3-1. Oh, and they're match against Ottawa South United. As we take a look here, Elena has picked up that ball, and what she's been doing all game, just turned on the Jets. Smith tried to come out the goal to close down the angle, but Elena will chip it over. As Winter, good touch from her towards Lewis down the right side. And it's a good turn there from Zabara. Here comes Zabara onto the run. Zabara gets around the defender. Zabara shot! Gets into the goal. There you go. Ottawa's not giving up on it. They get a second. It's 3-2. Zaina Zabara with her second goal of the game. Gets onto the ball off the run. And she's able to just have enough. As Zajkowski could twin poke it away. And the Murchie got a hand onto that one. But it wasn't enough to keep the ball out of the net. And how important... But Otto will be able to find as they kick that one, but just nobody in that space. And Colangelo will find it. 
as she'll continue to dance with this ball in the midfield as there goes the full-time whistle and the girls under 14 OPDL Gary Miller Charity Shield winners are Brampton Soccer Club with a 3-2 victory over Ottawa South United and what was a very tough game between both two teams in this cold Vaughn Sunday morning.